The National Rugby Sevens women's team, the Eagles, are back home after sealing qualification to the final round of the Rugby African Sevens Paris Olympic Games qualifiers. Ghana won four out of five games to place second in the tournament held in Lusaka, Zambia. These are the Gallant National Rugby Sevens women's team, the Eagles. They participated in the 2024 pre-Paris Olympic Games qualifiers in Lusaka, Zambia. The Eagles, led by Zimbabwean tactician Lavmo Dallas Kuzerera and Jeffrey Chiwanda, and Rugby Africa Women's Advisory Board member Rafa Tuinusa put up a show. They opened their campaign with a 24 points to 12 win over Côte d'Ivoire, silenced Burkina Faso with a 24 points to 0 win and wrapped up day one with an impressive last-minute win of 19 points to 15 over Zimbabwe. They made light work over DR Congo with 45 points to 0 win. In the final playoff game, the injury-ravaged Eagles side lost 26 points to 5 to Zambia to pick the second-place ticket. The team is back home to a hero's welcome. Captain of the Eagles, Paulina Menta, attributed the qualification to teamwork. Even though the weather wasn't helping, we try our possible best just to bring out the best. And surely to, we did our best and we came second. We are too strong, too quick, too fast. Everything, we make sure we go harder. So that's what we went to do. The team manager of the side, Madame Rafa Tuinusa, said the Eagles were properly psyched up for the competition. With all the countries that were present, Ghana was the smallest in terms of physique that you, you see there. But we also show them that uh, it's not all about uh, the physique. It's what we've been doing with our coach and our mindset. To the president of Ghana Rugby Football Union, now the president of Rugby Africa, Mr. Herbert Mensa, and his current working board members who supported us in so many ways to be able to come this far. We are grateful. We pray that in Tunisia we are going to bring the gold medal home. For the head coach of the side, Labmo Kuzerera, despite being happy at the performance, there is more room for improvement. It was a long time coming because we were prepared for it. Uh, we trained hard. I think it has been almost like five to six months preparing for this. And uh, for the girls to show up and actually give their all and uh, play to their full potential, it was great to see. The main focus was to qualify for the, uh, for the next tournament, which we achieved. The result means Zambia, Ghana and Zimbabwe have qualified for the final stage of the qualifiers to be held in Tunisia from the 14th to the 15th of October this year. The three countries will join South Africa, Tunisia, Uganda, Madagascar and Kenya to slug it out for Africa's representation at the Paris 2024 Olympics.